How do you feel the touch here? I've got a parcel. I know where it's from. Cosmo the Yorkshire Beauty sent it to me. He said, Vilt, can I send you something? It's, I think he's packed in here. Some heavy bloody stuff. He said, can I send you some stuff? What's your address? So I said, I'm not telling you. After the last time, uh, I had to move out. But yeah, he said, no, honestly, this time, cut away from yourself. This time, it really will be gaming stuff. So I gave him a new address, and he sent me some stuff. So let's see what it is. I not guess it's David Birdsall. It's in the box. It's in the Clark's box. Ooh, Clark's. Birdsall's got money. We didn't go to the proper shops like over that. To shoe fair. We only went to Clark's to get our feet measured. Then we went to shoe fair to buy our shoes. Let's have a look what Birdsall's bought me. But well, bought me, sent me. They could have bought me something. Oh. Shit in tracing paper. Oh. There's stuff under it. Right. First things first, Glider Rider. The music for Glider Rider, I was in, I've never played that on my channel, have I? Never yet. Right, that's on the list to play. What's oh, got a TDK print on the bottom there? Glider Rider, Sinclair User Classic. 180! I had Bullseye uh, for the Sinclair light gun. You know. Oh! <laughs> yeah, mate, mate made a mess. This. I had Bullseye for the Sinclair light gun. But, uh, I bought this at a catalogue shop, no an ex catalogue shop where they do discounts, where I got a slice by from it was uh, the same shop and uh, what I didn't know is the ex catalogue shop was selling these and it was a Spanish release, so the questions on Bullseye were all in Spanish <laughs> brilliant 180 next it's Yogi Bear. Those aren't the Spectrum screenshots. <laughs> They're not the Spectrum screenshots at all. Okay, boo. Next. Oh, trapdoor. Burke, where's my dinner? Oh, Globits. Still use old Globits today. I use it in the most, most uh, inappropriate. Moments as well. <laughs> I really do. Video Olympics. Anybody that's watched my channel before knows how I feel about sports and computer games. Video Olympics and ma from Mastertronic. Do those numbers mean anything on the Mastertronic labels? See, that's the MAD. MAD C, MAD C6. Right. I'll have to find... Oh, doesn't... Doesn't have a Mastertronic. Yeah, I got it. When we get to that one, we'll have a look. What's next? Ollie and Laser. Oh, my God. I haven't seen that in years. That used to be brilliant, didn't it? I'm thinking about the right Ollie and Laser, aren't I? 
These be brilliant. They look like that. Let's make screenshots. That used to be brilliant, I'm sure it did. Right. Feud. That is a fantastic game. Again, I'm not playing on my channel. Why can't I play it on my channel? That is I used to lose real time to that. Real time to feud. Next. Mastertronic. What's this? Non terra aqueous. Well, terra means earth. Aqueous is water. Non terra aqueous. Non terra, non earth. And aqueous. So, non earth water. Is that not of this planet? My Latin was green out then. I pretend to be fake. Oh, it's cassette. And this got a number on the side. I see 0078. What is that? Bring it up. IS0127. I've never noticed before. Anybody knows more about Mastertronic coding, please let me know in the description below. Description. Comment. Don't hack my description. Next. Thundercats. That has got an amazing music theme to it on this. Uh, I remember the game. It's a game a bit dodgy. I can't remember. We'll have to have a look, won't we? Thunder! Thunder! Thundercats! Ho! Oh! Wasn't there an episode where everybody was naked? If I remember rightly, on my internet looking, wasn't there an episode of Thundercats where everybody was naked? Well, it sounds cool, but there's no nipples. And no, and no catcock. Next. Oh, ATV Simulator. Now, everybody watched me play this a while back and knows how pissed off I got at those stupid budgies. Still a great game, but knows how pissed off I got. Stupid budgies. ATV Simulator. Features two player action. If you typed in two player action on Google these days, you wouldn't get ATV Simulator. Super Stuntman! Oh my god! I've not seen that in ages. Even forgot that existed. International instructions. <laughs> music by David Whittaker. That's got some awesome cracking music then. International Stuntman. No, Super Stuntman. International Stuntman. Cog. Saying it wrong for. Else is in here. Samurai Trilogy. So good they made it three times. Your Sinclair said, well drawn characters and a natty oriental and the natty oriental backdrops lend a touch of class. Uh, computing with the Amstrad says, the action sequence are varied and reflect the different styles of disciplines, three disciplines well. And what did they say? I can't see that. Oh, CCI, value for money, second to none. Well, that's all right. Originally from Gremlin Graphics. Samurai Trilogy. Never heard of it. Looks like it's got Kendo Nagasaki in it. What was Kendo Nagasaki's wife called? Again, comment below. She used to go with him everywhere, didn't she? Mouth on her. Can't, can I say mouth on her? I'm not allowed to say that. Marble Madness. Oh my god. How frustrating. Marble Madness and construction set. Was it Spin Dizzy I disliked or Marble Madness? I can't remember. One of the two really winds me to really flip up. Anyway, Marvel Madness. 
a your Sinclair Mega game. Oh, there's something else in here. Box. Oh, manual. Oh, two manuals. The introduction. I don't think I've got the introduction. And the ring binder. I haven't got the Sinclair, the, this version in a ring binder format. I've only got this as an air. Uh, I wonder what the difference is then. The introduction and that. Have I got it in the ring by the format? I can't see it. No, yeah, that's odd. I've got the ZX81 and the ZX Spectrum. That's weird. Well, I've got it now. That's weird. I'm sure I've seen that before on the shelf. That's confusing. Old Bill's losing his mind. That'd be good for me. I'm going to have to really look on my shelf because I'm positive I've seen that on my shelf. But it's not there now. Is there a book? Spectrum Games Master. I think I saw this on his channel the other day and I was quite jealous of it. I remember now, I told him to make some games. <laughs> this is going to be brilliant for me. I do like programming games. I've been sending a couple to George. <laughs> oh my god, look at that. How to make snake. This is going to be excellent for me. <laughs> this is brilliant. How to make snake? I would have di I would have digested this as a child, and I'm, and I'm gonna digest it as an adult. <gasps> How to make frogger? Leapfrog in this case, not frogger. Copyright. Ant Hill. Thank you, Dave. And that's it. Just a Clark's box, which I might put my own shoes in. Dave, why are you wearing those shoes? Not that I'm knocking you, you know, life choice and everything. But that was it. I am made up with that. I am truly made up. Stack of my. All those in the box. Oh crap. Nearly got. Yeah. Look at that. All's a gift. Cheers, Dave. But I'm off now. So TTF and everybody. Ta ta for now. Cheery on. Bye bye. Bye bye, everybody. Bye bye. That's brilliant. Where's my book? Should I have a book like that? You have to look at my bookshelf. Oh, better turn off the camera first, though.